Hit Film Sensei here. In today's video, we are going to talk about how to do special symbol characters in the Hit Film software. All right, so I'm going to leave a link in the description below to this website, and this is the Penn State University symbol codes. It's sites.psu.edu slash symbol codes and they have Windows and Mac. Now I don't actually have a Mac but I'm going to cover that real fast. If I go to the Mac setup and click on the option accent codes then what you will find is is that Mac has a really easy way to do these things right. Let's say I want to add an acute accent. I just say option plus E and then I type in the letter that I want to accent. It's a vowel Okay, usually like an O or a U or an E. Okay, if I want to do a circumflex, that little hat, then option plus I and V, and then the vowel. Um, a, a grave, which is a backward-like accent, you would do option plus a uh, uh, apostrophe, right? A tilde accent, an umlaut accent, the same thing, right? If I go down lower, you can see other things like an upside-down exclamation point would be option plus one, right? Uh, or if you want to go down further, cent sign, option plus four. You got the euro, you got British pound, you know, so on and so forth. Okay, also they have math symbols, and they have other punctuations like a copyright symbol, option G, a registered symbol, a trademark, etc., and so on. Okay, so those are, those are the way that you do it in the Macintosh uh, versions. Okay, Windows is going to be different, and I have a Windows, so I'm going to actually do it in Windows. So I'm going to click on the Windows Setup Alt Codes. And what happens in Windows is, is that you hit the Alt key and then you use uh, a um, four-digit code that starts with a zero, okay? So if you want the grave accents, uh, say a grave accent at O, then it'd be 0242. An acute accent, uh, 0233. Uh, and it's actually really easy, right, to do. You want to do a tilde, it would be, uh, you know, like a tilde on an N, 0, 2, 4, 1, so on and so forth. So what happens is you hit the Alt key, and then you do that particular signal, symbol. So for example, let's say that I'm in the Hit Film software. I create a new composite shot, and I click OK. And then I use my A icon here to drag a uh, text box, and then I type Hit Film Sensei. And let's say, for instance, that I want to center it, make it a little bigger. But let's say that I want to make this E uh, an, uh, with an acute accent to it. So I will go back to my uh, uh, reference area here, and I find out that that's 0233. Three. So after I'm here, I hit the Alt key, and I type 0233, three, and it makes a hit film sensei kind of a thing, right? Maybe I want to add a little copyright sign. So I go back over here and I come down to where it shows me those and the copyright symbol is 0169. So I go back to my hit film uh, software. I hit alt 0169 and it makes a little copyright signal. Now maybe that's a little too big for my taste. So I grab that and then I just make it a little smaller like that, okay? And basically, that's it in a nutshell. That's how you do those things. And you can do all kinds of strange symbols and all kinds of crazy stuff. But it's actually really easy to do. So if you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. Otherwise, thanks for watching. If you would like to keep up with the latest tutorial videos from HitFilm Sensei, consider liking the HitFilm Sensei Facebook page, following the HitFilm Sensei Twitter feed, and subscribing to the HitFilm Sensei YouTube channel. The links are in the description below. A new video comes out every Friday, and thanks for your support.